What's good y'all, it's your boy Chris here, your one and only data bunny. And in today's quick video, I am just gonna go over my uh, study materials that I am using for the CCMP and onward. Uh, so the track that I am currently going through is the CCMP Enterprise. And I wanna do a specialization in automation, so it'll be like the end auto. Uh, however, I am very interested in the advanced routing specialization as well so i might do that uh before the automation uh reason why you know my experience in different networking jobs you know seeing that event those advanced routing uh troubleshooting skills and seeing the many engineers that would go deeper in a route and that always interested me uh even way before i actually dived deeper into automation so definitely going to be doing ccmp enterprise and advanced routing and then take that further into automation because think about it what can you automate you have no idea how to use the devices right how they function so i do see that automation will work well especially if you know how those devices functions how the technology functions and how to go about doing that so i'm going to show you guys my books that i have so i currently have uh about four automation books and then I have the CCMP Enterprise Core with the with the um, the Ansari uh, book as well, and I actually bought the collection, so it's the actual uh, you know collection where I have the CCMP CCMP Enterprise Core and the Advanced Routing in one. So the first book, of course, I'm going to show you guys is the CCMP. This is the Enterprise Core. This is what I am uh, studying for, studying in right now. Um, I am currently on the uh, SD access, so the SD win and SD access section of this book. And what I am also doing as well uh, to supplement me reading is using the CBT Nuggets course. So as they are going through the skills, and uh, I complete about maybe six different skills per se, or you wanna say six different chapters, however you wanna describe it. I will then write those topics down in a notebook and then go into the book and then find them in the index and then find them uh, find them in the book actually and just go through it, actually read through them. And then once I'm done with that, I will go back to the CBT Nuggets video course, watch the next six skills, then go back to the book and just do the same thing. So this is a beefy book, you know, really beefy book. Uh, but there's a lot of content in it and I will say that uh, take your time with this stuff uh, I know I have a goal. I, I, I like to set a month how many uh, months I want to complete something or complete an exam I like to put a time frame in it, but I will say that um, You know, there's a lot of content in the CCMP Enterprise core, but I will definitely definitely take my time uh, With this material especially if I was you know, if you just getting in you know, you got your CCNA and you spend a little bit of time away from it while you went ahead and started gaining more work experience. You know, that work experience helps, but definitely still take your time with the content. All right. So that is the CCNP core, uh, enterprise core. Now, the next book that I do have, I have the, of course, that will come up next is the CCNP enterprise advanced route. I haven't read through this book yet, but um, it's about the same size as the enterprise core book but i will say there is a lot of topics in here that i'm very interested in as far as more about bgp and pls uh, ospf uh, eigrp a whole bunch of different routing topics in here and it just goes deeper in routing which i kind of i kind of like a lot uh it's the routing aspect and being able to then add automation on top of that you know that's it's a that's a game changer so that is definitely uh the two books that I have as far as the CCMP Enterprise go. Now, I also have a DevNet book that I had for quite a while. Um, even like when I even a little bit after I got my uh, CCNA books. So this is the DevNet uh, associate book. Uh, I have been reading through it and I love the content. It's very well put together as far as, uh, you know, especially when you're going first in it, first head in it and learn about software development. And that's what I'm actually going to school for uh, is software engineering. So being able to look through this, you know, and learn even more about software uh, development and how this plays a role in networking, 
it's pretty dope so uh this book i actually put a pause on it because i really want to stay focused on the ccmp enterprise i don't want to go all over the place with my studying i've done that in the past and i know many of you all you all did too as well but um this one i i see the associate but i also saw like the uh professional uh and i was looking through that i'm like man should i do that one or should i just continue on with the associate but we'll see but uh definitely uh definitely this book is hasn't ended yet cisco is still producing th this volume so yeah this is the cisco certified definite associate uh book cisco press i love these books and uh again what i'm going to start doing is taking video courses and then going back to them to them and then doing this so i mean this is this is a very thin book i will say that i probably uh will definitely uh enjoy this one just because it's it's very straightforward as soon as i got into it it was very straightforward so that is the definite now there are three i guess you can call um i don't i can't think of the name of it but more of like supplemental books or specialization books so we have um the network automation made it easy this these are a part of collection of three books that I've just bought so they're still fresh um, this one I got used uh, off of Amazon you know it's used but checked all the pages everything is still in it there's nothing wrong with the uh, pages at all uh, there's actually no writing in it so this book definitely goes into many topics as I can go do right here and I could probably bring some topics up so as far as uh, let's see here if I go ahead and I go to some of these topics, I'm just going to read some random ones, right? Data for network automation, using data from your network, right? Uh, using Ansible for network automation, Ansible basics. Uh, and then it go like network DevOps. It go to a lot of different topics, uh, but I'm actually pretty glad it goes into Ansible because I was playing around with Ansible. And it's pretty dope. I pretty li I really do like how Ansible works. Uh, when I first tried it out, so yeah, if you're if you're getting into Ansible, definitely take a look at this book. Um, and as, if you're doing like Cisco, definitely take a look at this book. But it goes into a lot of uh, Ansible topics, and it starts with the basics, which is what I really like. You know, you know, always start with the basics first, and then go a little bit more advanced down the line. So that's the Network Automation Made Easy book. The next one I have here is, is the automating and orchestrating networks with Net DevOps. This one I haven't taken a look at yet either. Um, this is a fairly new book that I bought. Used again, but it's like brand new. I yeah, I like <laughs> like you can't beat that. Like you have the new books and then you have used books that are just just as new as the used books as the new books actually. So um, yeah, so I, I'm flipping through it, but I didn't really read any of it but if i was to look in the back here you know understanding understand where net devops excels you know oh this book looks interesting and i'm definitely going to take a look at that as i get down the line you know we're doing things from studying reading then we have the video courses but in between that it's work experience job experience gaining work experience and then as you're working and learning new things, you know, you start studying and trying to match your certification level, your your studying level with your job, trying to keep that. Don't don't have like 50 certifications, right? And your job is not where you want to be at. You want to try to level them out. So that's what I'm sort of doing. That's why I advise everyone to do as well. Now, the last book I have here, but this is network programming and automation fundamentals this goes heavy so this was the book that uh, i looked through the most this one I actually did look through uh, not all of it but uh you know i <laughs> i began looking through it and i will have to say that this book goes through python it goes through ansible it goes through a whole bunch of other topics it goes through linux so you you get a whole rundown of linux how linux works and functions you know, there's a reason why this book is very thick, but I will say that the fact that it starts you off with Linux in the beginning and then goes deeper and then it starts you learn, you know, teaching you about Python and how to use Python and how to use this tool for network engineering. And it actually goes a little bit deeper in that. 
the other last two books goes uh, you know they're thinner but they you know they're more focused this one goes a little bit all out and it, it shows you a lot but uh, i would definitely say to pick this book up uh, network programmability and automation fundamentals definitely pick this book up because it, it goes through a lot and it's not something you just like read right you know all day or you just want to read that if you want to say hmm okay let me let me learn more about python and then they have a whole section for it for you it's an open library so those are my um those are my books ccmp enterprise core the ccmp uh advanced routing we have the devnet associate then we have uh, all of the other uh, network automation books that are that are a supplement to all of the content there. And yeah, that's uh, this is all I have for this video, guys. You know, I just want to show you guys what I use for studying. You know, CBT Nuggets as well. So I do video courses. YouTube, perfectly fine too. I will uh, definitely say that if there are some things that are missing where you're where you're looking at or where you're studying from. Def take a look at YouTube. You know, there's many people, many people that's been in a career for years that knows a lot and that are willing to teach you on YouTube, uh, which is which is great to have. So that is all I have for today. Please like, subscribe, share. And uh, yeah, tell me tell me what you all are studying with. You know, are you, are you all doing flashcards? Are you all doing uh, books? What type of books are you doing? Digital or physical books? You know, are you doing uh, video courses? What video courses are you using? Are you using CBT Nuggets like me or using, um, uh, you know, the other video courses out there? Just, uh, you know, leave leave a comment down below and we could probably chop it up when I have time to, to look through a lot of stuff. So, uh, hope you all have a good day. See you later.